people it's the xbox 448 and today i want to talk about one of my favorite franchises one of my favorite exclusives to the xbox xbox brand and that is fable um for people who don't know you know it was a while back but uh lionhead studios the developers of fable basically got disbanded all right and a lot of people were very very worried about the franchise fable fable um is a game where basically you decide how you do things it's uh decisions between good and bad and whatever conflict you have and your character as you make these decisions will reflect um the nature of, of them so if you start doing good things you know you start to look more pristine uh when you get to the higher like making good choices and stuff like uh you'll you'll get like these kind of like this angelic aura god rays and of course if you make the bad decision or the evil decision it goes the other way where you start getting pale and growing horns and stuff like that it's a really really cool game and it's um a game that helps define xbox as a platform but like i said lionhead studios was disbanded a lot of people don't realize or, or don't remember that when Microsoft was thinking about what to do with Lionhead Studios. They they tried to put it out there, kind of like for sale. And and there was a there was a bunch of uh, companies that wanted to buy that development team. They wanted to buy Lionhead, but with that they wanted to buy the title Fable. And Microsoft was not budging with that. And there's a reason why, because Microsoft has plans on making more Fables. And it actually has come out on Twitter uh, a couple days back where um, shout out to N Dragon or Dragon um, underscore light for, for tweeting out to Phil Spencer. And he basically said, he said, and I'm quoting, Phil, will we ever get a Fable 4? The original Fable played a big part for me in my life earlier when I owned an Xbox. Now, big shout out to him and... You see what I'm saying? It, it is a title that is a, a firm foundation within the Xbox brand. Now, Phil came out and stated that um, the Fable franchise has a lot of places it could go. But nothing basically to announce right now. Now, guys, we are going to get another Fable. I, I am basically calling it uh, me and my BGST brother crap. We also like he also believes another Fable is coming, possibly an announcement at E3. And with Phil Spencer saying uh, no announcement right now, it, it's an indication that there could very well be an announcement at E3. You know, he, he would say that there are no plans right now or anything like that in terms of the actual game development. But when he's talking about an announcement, that means there's something going on, you know, um, at the Xbox division. There's something going on, you know, it, with developers in terms of that game. And there's nothing to a, announce right now. See, you got to look into words when, when these guys are saying stuff. Because, you know, the PR departments, they train Phil Spencer, uh, Aaron Greenberg, Mikey Barra, you know, even Yoshida to a certain extent. Like, they... They train these guys what to say and how to use the right words. And uh, with that being said, it seems like there's a new fable about to be announced. You know, it's it's not coming out this year, guys. That's that's a big thing. That's something I want to say right now. Put that line in the sand. It's not coming out this year, possibly next year. Who knows? All right. But the thing is, uh, people are trying to like kind of dissect it. Is it a halo? Is it a fable four? Or is it a Fable reboot? And I want to throw my thought into this. I am hoping for a Fable reboot. I feel like the Fable franchise went too far ahead in time. And before you know it, with Fable 3, there were so many different types of handguns and rifles and stuff like that. It took away from, in my opinion, it took away from kind of like the core gameplay with the magic and the swords and stuff. So... I'm hoping for a Fable reboot. That's what I'm hearing. It's going to be a Fable reboot. So let's go back to the beginning and let's uh, kind of, you know, 
put it out there again uh make it a massive hit all that good stuff and i'm actually i'm excited for it i am a fable fan i did play all the fables one two and three i didn't really get into the the journey the connect one and uh i was in the beta for for fable legends as well which was looking absolutely gorgeous by the way before that game got canceled and then you know once that game got canceled then lionhead studios got disbanded but guys anybody who thought that fable was absolutely dead i've been trying to say it from the beginning it is not dead if it was dead microsoft would have sold that name along with lionhead studios made their few million dollars there and, and moved on but no they want to make more fables there's one in development right now and i'm saying that because of how phil spencer retweeted to that tweet so guys i'm excited i hope you're excited as usual if you like the gameplay you like the topics definitely hit that thumbs up button for me and if you haven't subscribed yet definitely subscribe but as for now this is the xbox 448 and i am definitely signing off